Imogen Coca, a luminary in the realm of comedy, has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry through a myriad of legendary works. One might ponder which of her many accomplishments stands as the defining moment in her illustrious career. Whether it be her iconic performances on stage, screen, or television, Coca's comedic genius resonates with audiences across generations. As we reflect on Imogen Coca's body of work, another question emerges, which piece resonates most personally? Among her repertoire of timeless performances, there's likely one that holds a special place in the hearts of fans. The answer may vary, as each admirer cherishes a different facet of her versatile talent. We invite you to share your thoughts on Imogen Coca's defining work or the piece that holds a special significance for you. What is your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic Hollywood actor? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Imogen Coca of Spanish and Irish descent had a rich heritage that traced back to Coca, Segovia, Spain. Her paternal grandfather's immigration to the U.S. marked the beginning of a legacy that would later unfold on the American entertainment stage. In 1973, tragedy struck when Coca faced a severe car accident, resulting in the loss of sight in her right eye. The rearview mirror impact caused not only vision impairment, but also a split leg, a broken cheekbone, and a fractured ankle. This incident left an indelible mark on her life and career, showcasing the resilience she carried. Behind the scenes, Coca's personal life interwove with her professional endeavors. Her first husband, Robert Burton, played a significant role in her career by arranging music for many of her sketches. Later, she tied the knot with actor King Donovan, a union that extended beyond personal life to the theater stage, where they often performed together. Imogen Coca's journey, shaped by heritage, triumph, and personal connections, stands as a testament to the complexities that fueled her success in the entertainment industry. A multifaceted talent, Imogen Coca's early immersion in the arts laid the foundation for her remarkable career. From piano lessons at the age of five to a solo singing debut at 11, her journey showcased a precocious talent that extended to dance by the age of seven. However, it was her breakthrough in the Broadway review New Faces of 1934 that propelled her into the limelight, marking the beginning of a prolific career in the entertainment industry. Beyond her artistic prowess, Coca faced a significant challenge in 1973 when a severe car accident resulted in the loss of vision in her right eye. This incident not only left a lasting impact on her life, but also highlighted her resilience in the face of adversity. Imogen Coca's legacy is one woven with talent, triumph, and the ability to navigate both the highs and lows of a storied career, making her a notable figure in American entertainment history. Imogen Coca, born to Joss Fernandez de Coca, a violinist and vaudeville band leader, and Sadie Brady Coca, a dancer with a magician's act, had a heritage steeped in the arts. Her early immersion in the world of entertainment set the stage for a remarkable career, that would leave an indelible mark on American entertainment history. From her solo singing debut at the age of 11 to a breakthrough in the Broadway review New Faces of 1934, Coca's journey was defined by a precocious talent that extended to dance by the age of seven. However, amidst her triumphs, a significant challenge arose in 1973. A severe car accident not only robbed her of vision in her right eye, but also left her with a split leg, a broken cheekbone, and a fractured ankle. This incident, while a setback, showcased her resilience in the face of adversity. Behind the scenes, personal and professional aspects of Coca's life intertwined. Her first husband, Robert Burton, played a pivotal role in her career by arranging music for her sketches. Later, her marriage to actor King Donovan extended beyond personal life to the theater stage, where they frequently performed together. Imogen Coca's legacy is one woven with talent, triumph, and the ability to navigate the highs and lows of a storied career. Her experiences, shaped by heritage and personal connections, stand as a testament to the complexities that fueled her success in the entertainment industry. As profiled in the book Funny Ladies by Stephen M. Silverman in 1999, Coca's life and career continue to be a subject of fascination and admiration.
During an evening talk show in 1960, she humorously recounted the comical side of audiences mistakenly thinking she and Sid Caesar were married due to their successful collaboration. Sid's wife, often mistaken for Imogen, took these comments in stride, showcasing a sense of humor that Imogen appreciated. Imogen Coca's journey from her diverse heritage to her triumphs and personal connections paints a vivid picture of a multifaceted talent who left an enduring impact on the American entertainment stage. A devoted animal lover, Imogen Coca's compassion extended beyond the stage. During a California vacation, she purchased a crippled duck for 60 cents and nursed it back to health on the terrace of her Manhattan penthouse. This act of kindness not only showcased her caring nature, but also revealed a lesser known facet of her life offstage. Despite her public persona, Imogen Coca was an extremely shy and gentle individual. Beyond her theatrical achievements, such as being nominated for Broadway's 1978 Tony Award for On the 20th Century, Coca's private life reflected a deep connection with animals and a reserved demeanor. Her commitment to nursing a wounded duck highlights a side of the actress that many may not have been aware of. Imogen Coca's journey, marked by triumphs on stage and quiet moments of compassion, creates a nuanced portrait of a multifaceted talent. From the Broadway spotlight to the tender care of a feathered friend, her life resonates with layers of complexity that go beyond the glitz and glamour of the entertainment industry. This blend of public success and private humility defines the legacy of Imogen Coca, showcasing the actress' ability to navigate both the limelight and the quieter moments of life. Imogen Coca's impact on comedy is well documented, earning her a place in Who's Who in Comedy by Ronald L. Smith. Born to a musical family in 1908, her journey into the entertainment world began with piano lessons at the age of five. Early immersion in the arts set the stage for a prolific career, marked by a breakthrough in the Broadway review New Faces of 1934. In 1973, tragedy struck when a severe car accident left her with vision loss in her right eye, a split leg, a broken cheekbone, and a fractured ankle. Despite setbacks, Coca's resilience shone through, reflecting the complexities that fueled her success. Beyond the spotlight, her personal and professional life intertwined. Her first husband, Robert Burton, played a pivotal role in her career by arranging music for her sketches. Later, her marriage to actor King Donovan extended beyond personal life to the theater stage. Imogen Coca's legacy goes beyond her theatrical achievements. A devoted animal lover, she showcased her compassion by nursing a crippled duck back to health during a California vacation. This act of kindness revealed a lesser-known facet of her offstage life portraying a gentle and shy individual. Whether navigating the highs and lows of a storied career or displaying compassion for a feathered friend, Imogen Coca's life resonates with complexity. From Broadway acclaim to quiet moments of care, her multifaceted talent defines a legacy that transcends the glitz and glamour of the entertainment industry. Notably, author Mike Sims, as a teenager, witnessed Imogen's comedic prowess during a play in Houston, TX. Sims and his friend caught her attention with uproarious laughter in the midst of the act, a testament to her ability to connect with audiences of all ages. Imogen Coca's story, encapsulated in Who's Who in Comedy, her resilience after the 1973 accident, and the unexpected encounters with fans like Mike Sims, all contribute to a nuanced portrait of a comedic icon. As the curtains draw to a close on this retrospective journey through the remarkable career of actress Imogen Coca, take a moment to bask in the glow of her enduring legacy. Her performances, a tapestry woven with brilliance and humor, have left an indelible mark on the annals of entertainment history. Now, dear reader, it's your turn to step into the spotlight of memory. Reflect on the moments when Imogen Coca's laughter echoed in your living room or when her comedic prowess brought tears of joy to your eyes. Perhaps it was a shared laughter with friends or a solitary chuckle during a late night show. Regardless, your connection with this luminary is as unique as her talent. In this virtual amphitheater of recollection, we invite you to share your favorite memories and thoughts about Imogen Coca. Let the digital stage be your canvas and paint it with the colors of your personal experiences. Through your stories, we continue to celebrate the artistry that transcends time. As we applaud the laughter she gifted us, the joy she sparked, and the memories she crafted, let us collectively raise the curtain on the grand finale. Imogen Coca's impact on entertainment is a symphony of laughter, 
and your stories are the standing ovation that echoes through the ages. Thank you for taking the stroll down memory lane, for sharing your reflections, and for being part of the enduring legacy of actress Imogen Coca. Your time and interest are the threads that weave the fabric of this shared experience.